Hey, good evening YouTube. So tonight I wanted to show you the second special from TobaccoPipes.com and this is very similar to the last one in that if you buy three tins you get three half ounce samples for free. So the, the motivation and the theme behind this one is different though. Uh, the theme is Cigar Leaf and the motivation is that it's been just about a year ago since I first discovered Cigar Leaf, uh, the style of tobacco, and really went crazy for it. I went out and bought several different tins uh, last year and smoked Cigar Leaf almost exclusively for several weeks. So now that spring's coming around the corner, um, I thought what better time than to put together a Cigar Leaf uh, tobacco combo. So let me walk you through them here. Um, another, another thing I was thinking about is I wanted this combo to be approachable both to the new pipe smoker, the seasoned guy, but also, and probably most importantly, to someone who's never had Cigar Leaf, but is kind of curious and wants to kind of uh, put one foot in the door and kind of figure it out. So to ensure that, I wanted to put some tobaccos in here that both had a little bit of cigar leaf and a lot. Uh, so you can get the, basically a, a taste and a profile of the range of the role this component plays in a pipe tobacco. So starting out on the light side would be McClellan's Dominican Glory Maduro. Now they do make a Dominican Glory uh, that is supposed to have cigar leaf in it. Uh, but it's almost undetectable. This one I think has just enough, um, it, it feels like maybe 5 or 10 percent, uh, but it has just enough to where you can kind of get the uh, get the general taste in the profile of what Cigar Leaf has to offer. Uh, so I kind of view among the collection here that this one is kind of the on-ramp. Um, it's a good way to to introduce yourself uh, to this style of tobacco. So this would be the lightest one of the three. Uh, it does have a little bit of that, a little bit of that uh, McClellan general flavoring, but nothing too major. The second one would be Key Largo uh, by GLPs. Uh, this one is going to be a world away uh, from Dominican Glory in terms of that robustness in your face cigar leaf uh, punch that it can offer. Uh, but it's also very refined. Uh, the cigar leaf is very robust but the rest of the tobacco is very well rounded. And that kind of pales in comparison to Billy Bud which is a little more classical uh, C&D. It's a little rough around the edges. Um, it's not rough in and of itself, but compared to Key Largo, uh, it has the same, uh, I would say, quantity of cigar leaf in it, so you get that same robustness. It's just, um, well, the name says it all. It's Billy Bud, and it, it smokes like Billy Bud. Uh, different cut, of course. Uh, Key Largo is a broken flake, and Billy Bud is essentially ribbon. So they, they do offer very different smoking experiences, um, not just these two, but all three. So I think it's a good way to kind of get your feet wet in, uh, in this style of tobacco and give it a shot. Now the motivation for the samplers here was different. Uh, on these, uh, last time I went with GLP samplers, this time I wanted to focus on kind of some undiscovered or hidden gems uh, within the C&D catalog. So these are all ones that uh, I had ordered before and had very little, very low expectations, and was really surprised um, with all three of these. So we have Cornell and Deals Crowley's Best, uh, Pegasus, and Winchester. And among the three, I would actually say Winchester is probably my favorite right now. Um, and it's my favorite because it, it really surprised me. Uh, what makes Winchester interesting is that it's just Cavendish and Virginia, and there's nothing else. And within my cabinet within my cellar, I don't think I have any blends that have just those two components. You know, usually you find Cavendish as a component in a blend that has three or four other things going on. But there's something about the way Cavendish and Virginia interact um, just by themselves in this blend that almost makes it mimic a kind of an English or Latakia type uh, flavor. So I had to double check online to make sure this didn't have any Latakia in it. Um, but it, it's, a, it's a real treat. I really, uh, really had a lot of fun with this one. So that's it guys, uh, buy three tins, get three samples for free. I'll put the link down below in the bucket. Uh, if you order it and you like it, or if you have any thoughts on it, uh, definitely share those with me. Uh, I'd love to know what you think of these blends. All right, thanks guys, and we'll see you next time.